So here is an aerial view of our entrance into our property. As you can see our driveway is actually on quite an angle and the original plan was to have the gates on an angle uh, with the wall straight. Um, but in the end we worked out that um, it was better to have the whole wall in a straight line and um, not have it uh, on an angle at all. So the first thing we did was actually order our gates for this project and um, we bought them on EasyGate because a friend of ours had purchased, recently purchased some. Um, we chose the uh, Chateau double swinging gates and then these ones here. Basically set the width you want and uh, the height and um, they have the pricing for you and the whole process was relatively easy um, in ordering them. So the other part of this project was actually the stone wall. Now we had an idea that we wanted to build a block stone wall, but at that stage had uh, no idea what we are going to do or how we are going to do it. Um, we took a trip here to Hinuera Stone um, and we walked around the yard and trying to figure out from the offcuts and their seconds and their returns what we could use to actually um, create a block wall. In the end we found these corner blocks here and um, I thought I'd be able to use those somehow um, along with um, these flat pieces in, the, in this crate here. From there I got those measurements and took them home and actually drew up how I would design and build the block wall and so um, I drew this up in CAD how we could use all the pieces and make sure that I had enough pieces to actually create a complete wall for our entrance. And then it was just a number of trips backwards and forwards to the quarry, which is about half an hour away, um, loading up and then unloading at our place um, the stone pellets.
Right, so the project of the day is to uh, put the hinges for the gates up on the two posts. Um, we've got the laser lever here, and uh, so we're going to set one up and then laser across from here to the other side so we get the, both the gates exactly the same level. Actually the concrete um, foundations are put in are very close to being perfect anyway so we shouldn't have too much um, issue getting this right. Now the gates are going to be 150 mils above the ground level across the bottom and the hinges themselves um, are off about 100 through the bottom hole are 130 mils so we need 280 to the to the first hole and uh, and then the rest of it all goes from there The gates are very close here in the middle, um, in fact touching, but there's actually still heaps of room over here. Uh, the problem is that this bolt is touching up on the so I just need to cut these bolts off on both sides um, to be able to wind them in a little bit more and uh, give me a bit more space to, to move these over closer, closer to the hinge. So that's what I'm about to do and we'll get that done and then there be more of a gap in the middle and here we go finished product um, so yeah so I just uh, cut those off a little bit I'll put a bit of paint on the back of that and um, yep it's all lined up nicely now it was uh, nice and even solid to give my aim off there but um, yeah these look uh, very nice very even <laughs> 